Uh, but each one of those things, physical, chemical, or emotional, knock the body out of homeostasis, out of regulation, out of balance. We have three types of stress that we process in the physical body. We have physical stress, that's like trauma, accidents, injuries, falls. Uh, and then you have chemical stress, like toxins or pesticides or pollutants or viruses or bacteria or hangovers or nutritional deficiencies. And then you have emotional stress, right? And emotional stress can be family tragedies, car accidents, uh, second mortgages, single parenting, 401ks, you know, whatever that is. Uh, but each one of those things, physical, chemical, or emotional, knock the body out of homeostasis, out of regulation, out of balance. The innate capacity of the body when it's not overstressed is that it wants to always return back and regulate, it wants to return back to homeostasis, it wants to return back to order. And that's innate in us. It's an automatic process that's running through the autonomic nervous system. So we could say the job of the autonomic nervous system is to create balance and regulation and homeostasis, and it's automatic. And that part of the brain sits under the thinking neocortex, and it's called the chemical brain, or the emotional brain, or the limbic brain, or the mammalian brain. And it has all of those functions that make blood sugar balanced, hormone levels, digestive enzymes. It's, 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 it's doing what it can to take the body and constantly repair it and regenerate it, move it back into balance. 